Hey guys, it's Shannon. And Paul. And it's Blind Bag Treehouse time. Yay, Blind Bag Treehouse. I love the treehouse. What about you guys? Paul loves the treehouse. Do I you love the treehouse? I love the treehouse. I love to set the treehouse up. <laughs> Leave a big thumbs up for Paul's awesome treehouse decorations. Okay, let's get to opening stuff. We're going to start right up here with this Lala Loopsy Tinies. This is a single pack and it comes with one character inside. And it's going to be one of these. And these are wearable, meaning you can turn them into jewelry, like bracelets or earrings or different things like that. So that's pretty cool. Let's see which one we get. Who, we get? Who are you hoping we get? <gasps> oh, I'm hoping we get this one. <laughs> <laughs> that actually was one of the ones you wanted. <laughs> <laughs> She's pink and adorable. I love her white hair. She is. I'm, I don't I'm even... guessing that's her. They're yeah, number 248. 248. Mm -hmm. She's cute. She's she really looks cute. like Little Bo Peep meets Cinderella. Little Bo Cinderella. <gasps> little Bo Ella. Or Little Bo Ella. We what? have a Little Bo Ella. We just have a Little Ella. Yeah, we have a Little Ella. <laughs> have you guys seen Ella the Kitty in any of our videos? You have to let us know down below. Okay, let's just stay right on there and open up this Heroes vs. Villains. This is a Funko Mystery Mini. And these are some of the people you can get inside. And look, I just noticed we uncovered Batman and Harley Quinn. Drake. Right. I mean, it's like, uh oh, another villain. Hope it's not another Harley Quinn. That would be Harley Twin. <laughs> Harley Twin. Well, good, good thing for Batman. We cannot get a Harley Quinn out of here. Yeah, good thing. Hopefully, it's not Jafar. Jafar freaks me out. This one feels really heavy. Let's see who it is. Oh, Ooh, it's a marshmallow. Marshmallow. And I don't know how you could be a villain with a name like Marshmallow. I mean, all, Marshmallow. All the scarier. <laughs> Taking like, something that you love and turning it into something villainous. <laughs> <laughs> He's awesome. I love this pose. He's like in action. Yeah. Action it's pose. Bicycles coming out of his back pose. Yeah. He's really cool. He is cool. See if he stands. Yep, he stands right good. Elsa. Elsa and Marshmallow. You guys like my Halloween nails? I have Frankenstein's. So you're probably going to see Frankenstein the most and leave have a, leave other a thumbs monsters. Thumbs up if you like Shannon's Halloween nails. Yep, thumbs up for Frankenstein thumbs. That's right. And <laughs> Two Frankenstein thumbs yeah. ups. <laughs> and you guys left enough thumbs ups to get me to wear the Monster High tattoos. I don't have them on in this video, but keep watching. In an upcoming video, I will be wearing them. I think we should make a special video. Paul wears tattoos. <laughs> That'll be the name. That way everybody knows that's the video. Okay. <laughs> you guys have to leave us a comment down below. Let, you know, let us know if you think that's a good idea. <laughs> All right, next thing. What should we open? How about the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle Mashem? It's super squishy. And this is Series 2. Oh, we don't have Simon with us today. He loves this plastic. Yes, he does. Simon's taking a nap right now. It's raining outside here today, and Simon is snoozing away. It's been raining here for days. Yeah. Oh, I was just going to say, I hope we get a foot soldier. Whoa, this looks like a special edition thing. But it's not. It's a foot soldier. He's awesome. He is awesome. He has a pink headband and a foot. A foot, because he's a foot soldier. Pink polka dot eyes. Yeah, I don't know what that's about. Blah, <laughs> blah. Look, at, look me in the eyeball. <laughs> These are fun because you can see the liquid inside them. You yeah. usually can't see that with mashems or fashions. Yeah, I, I like I like this turtle series a lot. They're really sticky. Yeah, they kind of are. He's funny. <laughs> Hello, everybody. Hello, foot soldier. I am a foot soldier. I don't know what that means, but I am one. So I'm left foot on my headband. There you go. Okay, now I think we need to open some Shopkins because we have two Shopkins packs up here today. Look at Minnie Mouse. We uncovered Halloween Minnie Mouse over there. Isn't she cute? Okay, let's open this season three five pack first. First up is Pop Rocks. Pop Rock. This would be something good to get if you go trick or treating. A bag of Pop Ooh, Rocks. Oh, that sure would. That'd be that an would, exciting treat. That would be. 
This is Jennifer Rain, the rain boot, which is very appropriate for us here today. Yes, it is. We need a tailor rain to go along with her. Yep. We also have Vicky Vac. <laughs> <laughs> She's going to sit by Marshmallow. And we have Petty Cake, which is an adorable little cupcake. This is a very fancy. This would be like in a specialty bake Yes, shop. it would be. Marshmallow's like, good. I'm glad you put the vacuum by me because I need to clean my little ice cave. That's right. Rather dusty. He's going to vacuum his ice cave. That's right. <laughs> and later on, I shall have a cupcake. <laughs> Let's see what our special mystery one is. Oh! Ooh, it's an ultra rare. This is Lammy Lamington. It's not really its name. <laughs> ha ha. This one is perfect for Paul. And you guys, if you've been watching this, you know why. So this is Lammy Lamington. It's one of the ultra rare chocolate frosted ones from season three. And this is a vanilla frosted one. Chocolate like frosted, vanilla chocolate. Chocolate frosted lamb. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. That does not sound good. Nope. But what do I know? All right, now we're going to go here behind Elsa, and we're going to open a little pet shop. I thought you were going to knock Elsa over. <laughs> this is a series one. I'm a professional. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this is series one of the pet hideouts, and it doesn't show us who we can get. So let's see. Hopefully it's Come one on, we know. Pet we know. I kind of want that elephant or the grumpy kitty. That reminds me of Simon. Yeah, the grumpy puppy's kind of cool, too. Here's our checklist. Which doesn't have names on it, so it's... These are the ones you can get, though. The little bird is cute. They're all cute. Ooh, look at the little purple elephant. I want a little purple elephant. Oh, that'd be cute. Let's see which one we have. Purple elephant. Oh! Nope. <laughs> this is a... Skunk? Squirrel? Squirrel or skunk? Squirrel? Skunk? Skunk? Skunking? I don't know. And it has a tire. And a little bow or a piece of candy in its hair. I don't know. It's either yeah. a bow or candy. Or a spider. Oh, it's a spider. A spider. Arachnus <laughs> deficus. So we have a little tire deco bit or um, accessory and this little guy, which is... Oh, you can turn his head. I'm Look. thinking that it is a skunk. That's just my guess. I would think a skunk with the tire. Yeah. If it was like an acorn or something, I would say a squirrel. So that was cute. Now let's open this. Oh, ah, there goes the skunk. Skunk down. This is the first time we're ever opening one of these. This is a new to us Tokidoki product called Royal Pride. And the box is really cute because Paul pointed out to me it's like a little subway car. And each side of the box has different artwork. <laughs> yep. Uh-oh. <laughs> <laughs> so that's really cool. Oh, I want that one right there. I like that one and I like that black kitty right there. Yeah. And the puppy is drinking soda that spilled yeah, on the ground. I don't know if the puppy's in this series or not. All right. Uh-oh. I'm going to... Yep, it's taped all the way down. Like, they're serious about the tape on this yeah. thing. Bling bag. Bling bag. Ooh, that sounded horrible. That was like nails on the chalkboard kind of stuff. Yeah. All right. Let's see which one we got. Who'd we get? Oh! Oh, look at him. Oh, he's sticky. Sticky? Huh. Why is he sticky? I don't know. His pants are sticky. Oh. I think he, there might be something wrong with this one. Huh. So he's like a criminal guy. He's got a, what looks like a jail shirt on because it's like a striped shirt and it has a, a number. Yeah. But he's got a crowbar, so I'm assuming he's in action. I like his head a lot. He could be a construction worker. No, he's not a construction worker. Yeah, could be like one of the demolition people that have to, you know, go rip out a countertop. I'm thinking that the paint or something did not dry all the way oh, uh -oh. on this. Cause it, or maybe the plastic's sweating. The bottom half is really sticky. Yeah, I mean, our house is cool. I don't, I don't understand why I'd be doing that, but that's weird. Yeah, hmm. but he kind of looks like a Halloween one. He does. The, these are cool. I mean, they're very edgy. That's for sure. I, I don't think these would be for little kids. No. But they're cool. They are cool. I uh, like its little jail cell number. Yeah. TKDK 5150. 50. Reporting for action. Yep. Now, let's open a Marvel collector key ring. This is series one. 
These are the people you can get inside, plus there are two exclusive ones. We haven't seen any of those yet. No, we haven't. So Something I've just see. noticed is, is it's all heroes. Oh, yeah. In this. Unless, unless one of the mystery ones is Who it. are you hoping's in here? Um, I, I want to see Rocket Raccoon. Yeah, I want to see Rocket Raccoon. Star-Lord would be fine. Spider-Man. <gasps> oh, I thought it was going to be Rocket was, Raccoon. I did, too. It's Star-Lord. It is Star-Lord. He's cool. What is he from? Guardians of the Galaxy. Same I don't remember him. He was the main guy. Oh, okay. Never he, mind. I yeah, was thinking... He, he usually didn't wear that mask. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Um, Rocket Raccoon, Groot, and Star-Lord are all from Guardians. So he looks cool. He does look cool. Star-Lord, after protecting the galaxy, was kind enough to come down and protect us from dinosaurs in Jurassic World. That's right. That's right. He's just a good guy. All over the place. He just helps everybody out. That's right. So that is a cool key ring. It is cool. I'm happy because it's one we don't have. Yep. All right. Before I open the Shopkin, I see something hiding behind it. Ta-da! Ta -da. We're going to open that. Huh, that's funny. <laughs> There's minis on both sides of the treehouse today. There were. Didn't realize that. So this is a Disney Infinity 3.0 edition Minnie Mouse. Let's take it out of the package and take a better look at it. All right, so in each package you get a collector card, and on the other side of the card is a code where you can get something special in-game. So I'm not going to show you the other side because I want to play with her. <laughs> But um, what's really nice about these figures is even if you don't play Disney Infinity, you can still collect the figures because the figures are really cute and really nicely done. Yes, they I think. are. So if you're just a fan of Disney stuff, you know, go yeah. ahead and collect them. Yeah, those are good quality figures. Um, but in game, you know, you set these on the little base and then your character comes to life in the game. So Minnie Mouse is one of the brand new figures that just came out and I wanted to get her because I need to master the toy box and figure <laughs> out how to use that. Right now I've been playing the Inside Out playset on this channel, which is a lot of fun. So check out Inside Out, but I'm going to be doing something with Minnie really soon. So mm -hmm. stay tuned. Make sure you watch for that. Okay. Let's open this My Little Pony right up here. This is one of the Sweet Apple Acres collection. Yep. And this comes from the collection with Applejack on the front. So if you guys have watched our recent videos, you know there's two different Sweet Apple Acre collections. One has Pinkie Pie and one has Applejack. And they have completely different ponies. All different ponies, except for Rainbow Dash. Yep. But the Rainbow Dash even is separate because one has yeah. glitter and one's clear. Yeah, and they're different colors. So. Pinkie Pie's different. So here's the collection. These are the ponies you can get in Applejack's wave. And we have Lucky Dreams. She's just, oh, I hiccuped, sorry. <laughs> She's just so lucky. She's another Indianapolis Colt fan. She is, she's like, uh, oh, what's his name? Sir Chancelot, or Chancelot. It was just Chancelot, not Sir Chancelot. <laughs> Sir Chancelot, I like Sir Chancelot. Yeah. So the ones from this collection are like this clear kind of see-through pony, and then they have glitter in them. Yeah, they're awesome. They are awesome, and I'm loving that green. Okay, let's open the Shopkins, and then we'll finish with the golden egg. This is a Shopkins Season 1 five-pack. Woohoo! Woo season 1, they do still exist. Yes. Online only. Yeah. <laughs> Let's open this up and see what's inside. First up, we have dollops. Whipped cream that you go... Chuk, chuk, chuk. <laughs> we can put that by the cupcake, because oh, cupcake right. could yeah. use some whipped cream. On top of the frosting. <laughs> this is mini muffin, and it looks like she's had some dollops right on top already. Yep. Muffins are just cake. <laughs> <laughs> Rock and Brock. Who does not need any whipped cream? Nope, because he's rocking. And lollipopins, the cutest little lollipop ever made. And we have a special one. What's in here? Ooh, Ooh it's wishes. It's a pink one too. She is an ultra rare from season one, and do you see all the glitter on her? She's awesome. She is awesome. Oh, pretty. That was a great one. All right, last but not least, we have a golden egg on a Play-Doh base. <laughs> All right, golden egg golden has egg come off on the Play-Doh. <laughs> Play oh. All right, let's see what's in here. 
Oh, it's a surprise egg with a Tokidoki half and half fat free mufia. Which makes no sense. <laughs> and Chaco milk. Chaco milk. Chaco, Chaco milk. milk. Chaco, Chaco milk. milk. <laughs> and one more surprise. Uh oh. Chaco milk. Stand up on your little legs. <laughs> Spilt milk from season one, Shopkins. It's a very dairy-based egg. Yes, it was a very milk-themed egg. <laughs> very cool. We got some good toys in that video. That looks awesome. It does look awesome. So, Paul, out of everything we opened today, what was your favorite thing? Oh, wow. Okay, so out of everything we opened today, I think I'm going to go with the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle Foot Soldier. The Foot Soldier. Yeah, the, good the choice. Good choice. Well, I will tell you, I was going to pick her, oh, the good. Lala Loopsy Tiny, as my favorite, but I'm going to have to go with Minnie Mouse because I was really excited to see her in the store and I want to figure out how to play <laughs> the toy box and have her in it. So I'm going with Minnie Mouse. She's a super cute figure. She is really, really cute. They did a great job. All right, everybody, now it's your turn to let us know who you liked the best. And make sure to leave those comments down below about if we should have a video with Paul doing tattoos only in the whole video. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for watching. Make sure to subscribe to PS Toy Reviews so you don't miss any of the new videos coming out. And we will see you in tomorrow's video. See you then, guys. I'm really happy about this video. And the reason why is because... It's going to be a Halloween video, and I absolutely love Halloween. It's my favorite time of year. You can see I have little Halloween monsters on my nails. And we have a special Halloween costume for Julie.